Hi. Welcome back everyone. Weekend again. I think we're at whatever it is, week four, five of this lockdown. Anyway, got a bit of a backyard cleanup job to do. We had a big tree overhanging and Melbourne had a series of really, really big uh, windstorms. So I was a bit concerned, especially with the boys playing outside. So we, uh, one of them fell down a little bit, so we had to clean up. So as you can see here, we've got a whole bunch of tree branches that I've got to put through the mulcher, um, which I'm going to do a review on today. So I've already done a whole bunch of mulching with it, and I thought, ah, oh, might as well do a review. So the mulcher that we're going to have a look at is the Azito 2400 watt silent shredder. It's uh, from Bunnings, and I just jumped online and had a look. They are three hundred dollars, um, and it's a pretty good deal. Um, seems to go through pretty well and chew up just about anything you can poke in the hole. So I'll just bring it over a bit closer. So it's pretty straightforward to use. Everything just goes down, and there's a big metal gear in there that just chews everything up. Whatever you can fit in the hole is what should get chewed on and off. It's got a forward and reverse, and you can actually adjust it, the cut. So if you're putting in slightly bigger ones, you can wind that out, and that'll, that'll actually move the blade back so that, that you won't get it jammed up. Um, it is fairly heavy, because obviously it's got a big motor in there, but it's quite easy to just tilt and start working through. And, um, yeah, so we'll get stuck into it. See what, uh, see what it goes like. I'll show you how quickly it goes. You want to turn it on, do you? Yeah. All right. You turn it on. They do have to turn on. Which one? This one. No, no, that top one. Oh, yeah. Good job. all done now from you know I've only got the big stuff left which I'll have to cut up with the chainsaw but uh, overall thoughts on this uh, probably the biggest design flaw is this tapered box where all of all the uh, the wood chips get funneled into if you get a few branches and so on they can get clogged up and you're sort of forever having to pull out uh, the bits and pieces from in here because it does tend to yeah like I said clog up fairly regularly if I had that just open or flared the other way you wouldn't have a problem um, if it gets jammed I had a few jams uh, quickly just jam an Allen key in there, give it a wind out, pop it out, wind it back in, and away you go. Um, but, you know, overall, 300 bucks, how often are you going to use it? You know, there are cheaper ones out there. There's another model that's a bit noisier, I think. Uh, obviously, never used that before, but um, for the scheme of things, when you do need it, if you live on a, a fairly, you know, uh, tree area that you're always wanting to get mulch out of. As you can see, I've got a fair file here that I'm going to probably just put in the wheelie, wheelie bin or maybe just spread it out. Uh, I think it's a pretty good deal. But uh, yeah, so anyway, I hope you enjoyed the review and if you've got any questions about it, uh, let me know. Have a good one, I'll catch you on the next video.